Everyday scientists discover new and fascinating animals in the waters, and with so much of the ocean still unexplored, we have no clue what could be lurking in those massive depths. Some of the creatures the ocean holds are vicious enough to attack even land animals. Sounds unbelievable, right? How can something that lives in the water hunt something that doesn't even live in the same ecosystem as it? Well, as unbelievable as it sounds, it's true. And luckily for you, we've compiled a list of 10 such animals that live in the ocean and eat land animals. Let's get right into it. Number 10. Orcas First off, we have the notorious orca, aka the killer whale. As a species, it has a diverse diet and gets its fair share of nutrients from land mammals. And who can blame it? I mean, look at that size. Being the top predator in the ocean and the largest predator of land mammals isn't an easy job. You don't get that kind of energy from eating krill all day. Unlike the typical marine animal that feasts mainly on fish and marine mammals, the orca has been seen eating over 140 species of animals, from fish to sharks, sea turtles to birds, and even moose on some occasions. The orca can't really survive on land, so how it managed to get its hands on a moose is a wonder of its own, but I think we can all agree that it enjoys a pretty well-balanced diet. Number 9. Silver Arowana The silver arowana is also known as the flying fish, the monkey fish, and the dragon fish. It's a popular fish among aquarium enthusiasts, although it's not recommended as a pet for amateurs due to its large size and hunting capabilities, which you'll soon find out about. The silver arowana is a freshwater fish native to the areas of Southern America, but it's always in search of an opportunity to expand its hunting ground. In case a forest habitat is flooded, these devious little things take the chance to spot a delicious looking meal in the treetops, then launch themselves towards it. After successfully devouring the animal, they return underwater. Number 8. Tiger Shark Calling the tiger shark a predator would be a bit of a stretch. The tiger shark is a pure scavenger, meaning that it'll feed on anything and everything it finds near its habitat, provided that it's edible. Wait, no, scratch that. Captured tiger sharks have been found to consume even license plates and old tires on occasion. And all we can really say about that is mood. Tiger sharks are notable for the fact that they really have no limit to what they can eat, which also makes them the most relatable wild marine animals. They typically feast on seals, squids, and unsuspecting birds sitting peacefully on the surface of the water. The shark pounces on them artfully without making a sound or a ripple in the water and devours its meal with its sharply serrated teeth and strong jaws. Most of the time, the prey doesn't even know what hit it. Number 7 catfish. We'll have you know that this is the actual catfish we're talking about here, not the type you see on tender profiles. Measuring 1.5 meters long, the catfish is the largest freshwater fish in all of Europe. It has somehow taught itself to hunt passing birds and has therefore become a force to be reckoned with. Pigeons often gather to bathe themselves on a small island in the middle of the river Tarn. Little do they know that in the peaceful waters of this river, European catfish scavenge for food. The catfish launch themselves out of the water, grab one of the unsuspecting pigeons, and wriggle back into the water to dine on their new catch. They risk getting stranded on land, but it's a strategy that usually pays off. Number 6. Giant Trevally While filming the critically acclaimed documentary series Blue Planet 2 off the coast of Seychelles, the BBC crew managed to capture incredible footage of the moment a giant trevally leaped out of the water to catch a passing bird in its mouth mid-flight. The giant trevally is a bit larger than your average fish. It measures a whopping 5.5 feet in length and weighs over 168 pounds. We have BBC to thank for pretty much everything we know about giant trevallies today. Number 5. Killfish This small hermaphrodite may not be all that scary looking, but it's one badass fella. It's often kept as a pet in aquariums, and it's nothing like your usual goldfish or clownfish. Unlike other fish, the killfish isn't all that fond of swimming. Oftentimes it lives in puddles or small pools or sometimes out of the water entirely. It can survive out of the water for over two whole months hunting animals. 
It particularly enjoys the taste of crickets and insects that live on leaves. They leap upwards towards the branch and return to their ponds after snagging their target. Number 4. Archerfish The archerfish is a considerably advanced predator for a fish of its size. It has evolved from a generic average species to a fully capable hunting weapon. Its diet typically consists of insects that live on treetops and branches. So how does an animal that lives in the water manage to hunt in the trees? You would expect the archerfish to be true to its name and launch itself like an arrow towards its prey. But that's actually not the case. You see, the archerfish has a handy little trick. It fires a weapon. An aggressive stream of water to be exact. It hits the target like a bullet instead of the steady stream of a water pistol. The insect then falls into the water and right into the archerfish's trap. Number 3. Snakehead Fish The snakehead fish is native to Asia, but it's since been discovered in American rivers as well, most likely as a result of somebody releasing a pet snakehead into the wild. Much like snakes, their diet consists of whatever living animals they can get their hands on. Snakeheads have often been caught wriggling their way out of the water and hunting for their prey on dry land. That's right, on land. And they often succeed, too, managing to eat birds, rats, and even snakes. No wonder they're known as one of the most determined and bold animals on the planet. Number 2. Eel Catfish The eel catfish is an uncanny and slithery air-breathing fish native to Central Africa. It has an upper hand over other predators with its genetic ability to breathe on land as well as in water. Underwater, it acts as a filter feeder, sucking water and food directly into its mouth. On land, the eel catfish raises the front half of its body and bends its mouth down over the prey, a feat that's possible only because of its highly adapted spine. Their diets generally consist of underwater fish and other small sea creatures but they're more than capable of expanding their targets. Number 1. Rainbow Trout At number 1, we have the amazing rainbow trout. The native wildlife in New Zealand is both beautiful and, um, weird. The rainbow trout is very popular among fish enthusiasts and chefs alike, but lately, fishermen have discovered an unusual phenomenon with them. These marine creatures seem to be getting larger, and what's even more strange is they seem to have developed a taste for mice. We have no idea why or how it's scavenging rodents, but the phenomenon seems to have been occurring since the 1950s. It just goes to show how incredible the animal kingdom can be. That was all for today's video. We hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to like, subscribe, and click on the bell icon to support us and stay tuned. See you next time. Peace.